As many try to stay home because of the storm, one St. Louis mother had no choice but to brave the weather. Well, she went into labor yesterday and gave birth this morning. Fox 2's Amelia McGavro is live now at Mercy Hospital, where that baby just came into the world. Amelia? Yeah, Mandy, that baby is doing just fine, thankfully. But the mom says she was very, very grateful for the doctors and nurses that came to work today to help patients like her, even if it was in the middle of a snowstorm. And when he came out, I'm like, that's just like the biggest relief I've ever had. Jada Jarrett is now a new proud mother to baby Nasir Walker, a baby with a unique birthday. Here he is. He was born at 222 on two. To 2022. You heard that right. He was born at 222 AM on 22 in 2022. Not only that, he was born in the middle of Wednesday snowstorm, which kept Jarrett's family from being at the hospital. They had a phone call for me at least every 20 to 30 minutes. I'm like, okay, I'm calling somebody, whether it was my mom or group FaceTime, you know, I was on the phone with somebody. <laughs> so I'm like, I just want, I definitely wanted to make sure everybody, you know, felt some kind of included. Jarrett says she was grateful for the nurses and doctors who cared for her and many healthcare workers across the area also braving the snow and ice to get to work. Their dedication is amazing. Janice Lewis is the nursing administrator at SLU Hospital. She says the hospital has practically turned into a temporary hotel with beds and showers for staff to spend the night. And we have been at capacity for quite a while. And of course, when there's bad weather, we have a really hard time with discharges and things like that. So not as many people are leaving the hospital as they usually do. So we end up pretty full during those these periods of times anyway. Vice President of Operations Brian Walrath says the hospital has had to reschedule some appointments at their outpatient clinics, but everything has run pretty smoothly. He says the focus is keeping staff safe. Staffing has to be the, the biggest challenge, but again, it's all about safety and it's trying to get them to, you know, obviously be ready for that next shift opportunity and not have to get on the roads if they don't otherwise have to. And Jared says she's staying at the hospital with her baby until Friday due to the storm and for medical reasons. Live in St. Louis, Amelia McGalvero, Fox 2 News.